video may come off as a shocker to you, but homesteading really isn't my thing. When many think of homesteading, they think of gardening, chickens, canning. Many of those things are in fact my things. But at this point in our journey, that is not what homesteading looks like at all. Homesteading looks like working in the hot, hot sun with shovels and excavators. Homesteading looks like standing in a deep, muddy trench with rocks flying in every direction. Homesteading looks like being on your hands and knees, getting up close and personal with plumbing projects. Homesteading looks like learning how to run a chainsaw and finding ways to lift things a hundred times your weight at least. Homesteading means pushing yourself on a daily basis and working until the job is done, regardless of the temperature, time of day, or whether or not it's convenient. Homesteading includes electricity, wiring, plumbing, construction, power tools, engines, big machinery, and even taxing physical labor. These things are not my things, far from, in fact. So then you might ask yourself, as many have asked me, why the heck do you do this? The answer, I have goals to accomplish. One day long ago, Jesse and I sat down to describe our perfect life. What would it look like? What would it feel like? We wanted to live in a beautiful area that spoke to our soul when we walked out the front door. We wanted to spend our days doing what we enjoyed instead of being stuck in a nine to five job to keep up with our mounds of debt. We pictured being able to spend time with our future family. It crossed our minds that one way to further along our dreams was to build our own home, cash. No debt, no mortgage. Certainly nothing that would keep us slaves to jobs we hated for the next 30 plus years. What if all we had to do was be patient, learn the necessary skills, and work together as a team through thick and thin? So we're going for it. We believe in our dreams so much that we're both willing to make huge sacrifices to make it happen. To all the women out there, and even the men, that have lots of strenuous, ugly work standing between you and achieving your goals, don't be afraid to get down and dirty and learn something new. The tasks you do do not define who you are as a person. They're simply a means to an end. As a woman, doing what's stereotypically a man's job, doesn't make me any less of a woman. In fact, it makes me a stronger one. We're more than excited to see what 2017 has in store for us. We're excited to share with you our house plans in the works, and we're gonna make the best dang push we can this year. Here's to achieving your dreams, no matter what stands in your way.